The red light's on. Yeah, it's been on for how long? 57 seconds. All right, let me put my water over here. Talk time. Talk time. Take one. Take one. So here we are, Doug. It's your ball game. It's no, no, it's both of our ball games. It's always both of our ball games. I just uh, take the lead a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I have a cold today, so excuse me if I sound like a man. I, I'm not. I'm still Tanya. <laughs> Thank goodness for that. <laughs> I need to rethink my <laughs> relationship here. <laughs> yeah, I guess you would. So it was another dreary day, and I'm kind of glad it's over. We were going to have a party last night, but uh, not too many people showed. And, you know, in all reality, it was kind of, not to be mean, but it was kind of nice because we were both tired. We weren't really in the party mood anyway. But if they would have showed, we would have. Oh, we, we would have livened up. Would've we would have perked, perked up real fast. <laughs> oh. So we just had a nice meal with our my parents and... Lindsay Kimberly, and and, yep, and Jack and Yara, and we just kind of relaxed. Still a good evening. It was still a good evening, yeah. So, here we are tonight, and we're going to uh, do the drawing first. This is for uh, somebody to come on with us on Talk Time and discuss, and they'll pick the topic of what they want, and they'll also get $100. Now, the people, the, some of the people don't care if they get the 100 or not, but it's just... <laughs> But it's, it's just like an added bonus. It's like I can have ice cream. I can have a big old bowl of ice cream. But if I put hot fudge sundae on it, you know, I mean hot fudge on it, it just kind of adds to it. Yeah. It makes it just that much better. So talk time is kind of like the ice cream. And the $100 is sort of like the hot fudge. Why don't we just offer ice cream with hot fudge? Ooh, you know what? I, well, no, I could buy a lot of ice cream with 100 bucks. Yeah, so. you could. But anyway, this is for $100, and this person will be coming to join us in June for talk time. And we'll work out with them what the schedule is for the recording. But guess who we're having in the month of May? I don't know, Tanya who? <laughs> I know this is surprising <laughs> to you, Doug. Your brother David. He is coming to join us in the month of May. He'll pick a topic. Your brother is into all kinds of things when it comes to um, Jesus likes, and God. He likes history. He likes history. History. So I was history was never my topic of anything of any history of anything. You know, I stink at history. So if at any point in time when David is speaking or you two are speaking about this and you see me kind of just like looking around and gawking, you'll know, like, I'll be back in school the way I was in school. But no, it should be interesting, because sometimes if you really focus on the history of things, you get to know things so much better. So we are looking forward to David coming. But tonight, Doug, I would like you to draw. Now, only four people were in the drawing, so they have, I said drawing, drawing. So they have a 25% chance of being picked. But the good thing is, if you don't get picked tonight, we're going to do another drawing for the month of July. Same thing, 100 bucks. you come Where's to the Where's all show. the money coming I from? I don't know. I, I just, it, it's just, you know we have that money tree out back. If, <laughs> you know it's out there. We'll just pluck another $100 bill off of now it. Now, you all know that money doesn't grow on trees, and this, this ministry has to keep on growing, and we need funds. So <laughs> yeah, we need funds to sit in our You can call basement. the hotline anytime at <laughs> BR549. <laughs> BR549. That reminds me, you know, when you said BR549, that uh, John Topper, who used to sing that uh, little jingle back in the day when we were still in high school, and uh, it was Carl Feather Holmes. Call six two three nine six one two Carl Feather Mobile Homes. I don't know and, if I ever knew he did that. Oh yeah, do you remember the jingle? No. Oh my, yeah, it was almost. I mean, it was on so much on the radio that, uh, and once in a while, if Dad had to drop me off at school or pick me up at any function <laughs> with the Carl Feather Home Band, I, you know, it was kind of embarrassing. <laughs> but you know, random people would come up and say, "Call six two three nine six one two Carl Feather Mobile Homes." Uh, I never knew oh John yeah, Papa it was that. yeah, it was I'll a good have to ask him next time I see. You, so. Well, he's that's been a long time yeah. ago. So, what uh, probably about forty years ago, he would have done that. That's sad that I'm that old, but the rest of us are. Yeah, too, you guys are too. <laughs> 
So where were we? You didn't do it all by yourself. <laughs> oh, we're getting ready to draw. But the thing is, in the we'll, we're going to do a drawing in the month of July, for July and also August and maybe September. So you guys still have time to be put in the drawing for July. Bring so, food because we won't be able to eat. But the thing is, we'll give whenever the person comes to do talk time is when we'll give them either a gift card or just a hundred dollars in cash. Sounds so we'll, they'll just get it when they come to do the episode. Doug, I'm going to have you draw. There are four, four. Oh wow, he didn't even take any time to think. Let's see who it is. Drum roll, please. <laughs> Doug Miller. <laughs> yeah. That you get my hundred dollars. I want my hundred dollars. Yeah, yeah, I know who is it. Autumn Brandt. Autumn Brandt. <coughs> Beautiful and lady. Bring your husband with you. She said she would. She said she would. I checked in with her to see if it was going to be her, if she was drawn, or her hubby, and she would like to talk about marriage and what God can do in a marriage. So she said she wasn't married to herself. <laughs> so both of them <laughs> were <will be> coming. <laughs> When he comes, we'll sit upstairs and watch baseball and drink beer. And <laughs> yeah, no, I don't think so. So we'll get a hold of you, Autumn, and we'll schedule a time. We can record any time in the month of May uh, to air in June, or we can record sometime at the beginning of June. Uh, but we'll probably air it sometime mid-June. Sounds good. So we'll contact you. This will be great. Autumn is a fun gal. I don't know her hubby, but you did. You uh, met him at Trace Diaz. Yep. So. Good guy. Yes. All right.